Jester is my favorite YouTuber, and I'm gonna 1v1 him by the end of this year. Today is day 7 of training, and I'm summarizing this week. Again, working on shooting, ball handling, creating space, and different finishes. Next week, we will be put to the test in a lot of 5-on-5 five five and 1-on-1 one -on -one competition. So today's a big day. I'm starting off with light shooting around the perimeter. If you haven't been following the series, I'm training for 30 days to beat Jester in a 1v1. I'm calling my favorite YouTuber out. I think Jester's the Mr. Beast of basketball content, and I love how he's made basketball so much fun to watch. His energy and personality brings me joy and made me realize that I wanted to be a YouTuber, to do the same things for all of you. So that's why I'm training for the next 30 days, because if I can beat the best, then I can be the best. But there's a huge problem. I'm experiencing extreme fatigue and my legs are super tight. This is altering my shot completely. I'm trying to push through for all of you because we hit 300 views on my day two of training video, which has given me so much motivation that Jesser will see this all soon. So I'm gonna push through and let's see what happens. If you're not getting good reps in, you shouldn't be in the gym. You wanna make sure every rep is game-like, make sure every rep is benefiting you. And so, I'm definitely gonna need a stretch today. Before they were to change my perspective. This challenge is starting to get to me a little bit. It's a lot, it's a lot. I work a full-time job, so I work from 8 a.m. to 4 o'clock. And then after work, I'm doing YouTube, filming this basketball stuff, and editing it all on my own. If you love me and you're enjoying this 30-day challenge, please subscribe, please like, please comment, please share with all everybody you know. I think today's a great rest day. Because tomorrow I'm playing five on five, so I'll see you there. You see me and I'm grinding.